Burlington's Made Here Film Festival is celebrating its fourth year. Now, during the four-day event, they are showing dozens of films made by filmmakers from New England and Quebec. NBC5's Tyler Baronski spoke to both aspiring and professional film industry members about what they hope to get out of this event. The Made Here Film Festival is an opportunity for our region's best film professionals to showcase their work while also giving back to those hoping to be in their shoes one day. As the lights dimmed and snacks in hand, eyes were glued to the big screen to witness some of the best films that New England and Quebec's finest had to offer at the Made Here Film Festival in Burlington. Then it was a chance for those aspiring to be in the industry to learn from some of the best of the best. There's a lot of plan. Yuan Zhao has been making student films at the University of Montreal. He wants to be a movie director, so Zhao came here to learn from those that have been doing it for decades. How they get funded for their films, how they make their films, so yeah, it's really interesting. Rick Clark is one of those industry veterans that the festival invited to be here. He's been an award-winning film and TV music supervisor for more than 20 years, in charge of choosing the right music to fit the scenes of your favorite shows and movies. Clark says he loves any chance to give back, and meet those that want to be in a position like him one day. Feeling the culture, feeling the people, the creative community, and seeing how can I help. It's a strange thing when you give to people, you walk away feeling nourished. Tom Perro is making that happen locally in Vermont. Maybe you know a piece of music that you want in a film, but then being able to actually license it is a it's a world apart. His company, Big Heavy World, connects Vermont musicians to Vermont filmmakers, creating that bridge to have talent in the Green Mountain State get their opportunities, while also falling in line of the Vermont way of thinking, keeping it local. You're buying local, you're investing local, why, why shouldn't we be using local music in local films? The college student from Montreal says he's already taken inspiration from the films he's seen and the conversations he's had, ready to take those lessons back with him to campus. It's interesting to see like what's the work that's been that, that other people are doing like over here. The Made Here Film Festival wraps up tomorrow. If interested in attending, we have that information on our website, mynbc5.com. In Burlington, Tyler Bronski, NBC5 News.